Really good question. Number two is how will I know when Spanian's ready to fight? So anyone who's learning how to fight or do anything really, you go through different stages of learning. You go through what we call unconscious incompetence. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know how to fix it. Uh, conscious incompetence. Uh, I can see what you're doing, but I can't do it. So you consciously know that you, you know, you're messing up. Then we go to what we call conscious competence. You think about it, and if you really think about it and focus, you get it right. And then of course there's unconscious competence. Unconscious competence means you do it automatically. A bit like walking, you just walk down the street and you don't really think about it, or you shouldn't be thinking about it. Uh, but when you're a baby and when you learn to walk, you have to really think about it. If you've ever seen a baby try to walk, and become a toddler, they kind of stick their hands out and they waddle through things and it's kind of funny because they're having what they call conscious competence. So Spaniel will be ready to fight when his uh, defense has good, what we call unconscious competence. He defends himself automatically to most things most of the time. And his offense can work like that as well. He sees the opening automatically happens. And we want to make sure that he... Uh, also has what we call conscious competence so we sit down in the corner and say hey that guy's open for a low kick kick him and then he can think okay i'll aim for the leg and i'll win the fight like that so that's when we know not only if spaniel's ready to fight or if anybody when they're most of the time having good unconsciously competent defense offense is easy